All right, everybody, it's Art Clow here, and what a great video I have for you today. <laughs> I want to talk about Dale Gribble from King of the Hill and how I feel that he has... Um, All right, everybody, it's our Clow here, and what an amazing video I have for you. I want to talk about Dale Gribble from King of the Hill, and for those of you not familiar with the show, uh, Dale is a renowned conspiracy theorist, and I want to talk about how I feel one of the biggest clues in understanding the powers that be, the New World Order, or at least a big aspect of it are right in front of him and us for the show's 13 year run now i am referring to the hat that dale wears for mac trucks and throughout this video i want to discuss the relationship between mac trucks and dale and i'm going to use not only traditional research methods this is for those of you unfamiliar with this channel but I'm going to also be utilizing uh, things such as numerology, tarot cards, and very heavily using gematria, which simply put is an ancient form of encryption by which every letter is given a numeric value and then the sum of every word and phrase are said to then correspond with different pieces of this giant interwoven web of information. So. I highly advise you to look into this, uh, these research methods if you're unfamiliar with them and you will very quickly see that they do play a very prominent role in this modern world that we live in and in just conditioning us to see these pieces. Um, again, predictive programming, all of these different um, <clears throat> conceptual terms that we've given to it uh, but again putting it right in our faces um, so that right it's in essence we have the ability to know better but so with all of that being said before I even get into this I guess I want to talk a little bit about how this idea even came up to me here why I'm doing a video on Dale Gribble um, <clears throat> and it basically comes down to Dale <laughs> is at the foot of the show's longest running joke which is really unfortunate as it is pertaining to his wife Nancy having an affair with a man named John Redcorn now this affair um, is so serious that Nancy actually has John Redcorn's son and Dale is completely unwilling to accept this reality he instead chooses to believe the idea that aliens impregnated his wife while well, because he was away during the time in which Nancy was impregnated um, and again this detachment from reality um, but so the truth is right in front of his 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 eyes the entire time and he refuses uses to acknowledge reality for what it is now the irony here is that Dale is a massive conspiracy theorist right which focuses on looking at the reality that is being veiled from us and so not seeing what is right in front of him um, is right just very excellent writing from Mike Judge but I feel he takes it one step further and gives us this clue with Dale in the form of the Mack truck hat because it's right on his third eye. Now we'll discuss this later with Mack trucks and everything. I really want to get into this coding though and let's start with Dale because it is very interesting here. So it's a four letter name that starts with the fourth letter of the alphabet. So we have that nice 44 there. Now any of these numbers that are intervals of 11 are incredibly important. I've talked so much about them in the past as well as a number of these tarot cards that I'm really just going to mention them and if you're unfamiliar with them I advise you either ask me in the comments about them or research further um, and start to see more of the information that is there. So do notice, though, with this 44, it is the same uh, Jewish value as Mac, which again, M reduces to 4, and it's another 4-letter word. So there you have that 44. Now, 
let's keep moving here though so if we break 44 down we get 16 now this is the tower uh, excuse me the tower card this is the idea of order out of chaos essentially and so is very important card and <clears throat> it will come up later as dale alvin gribble his full name is 16 letters long now if we break it down one further one and six gives us seven now this is an incredibly important number um <clears throat> in just a cold everything if you look here you can see the mark of the beast is seven points as well as the seal of babylon you can also think of the rainbow flag again the seven colors of the rainbow seven deadly sins and <clears throat> again the whole idea here is that seven generally comes off as a number of good fortune and that is as always by design so that people feed energy into what is actually a very negative force now keep looking here though and again the chariot card is very important but so gribble starts with the seventh letter and is seven letters so it's just like dale in that and so we have 77 break it down we get 49 4 and 9 gives us 13 it is the death card now do remember that this show king of the hill went on for 13 seasons and very interestingly 99 days after the final episode premiered Brittany murphy died now <laughs> there's a lot that could be said on that but that's not what this video is about I want you to see here, um, if we break 13 down, 1 and 3 is 4, the Emperor. Now these are dual readings here, the Tower and Chariot, as well as the Death and Emperor. And again, Death, Transition, Progression, Emperor is Limitations, Government, those sorts of ideas. So you see how it all fits together with that. Now you can go all day with these 4 and 7s between his names here. They're very interesting the way they break down, the way they invert. Um, but to take it one step further, he's actually said to be age 47 in the show. So you can take a look at that there. And so if we look at this gematric coding for 47 you do see it is the same as skull and bones as well as the number 66 which is immensely important the path of resh again talking about the sun card worship of the sun what so much of this ultimately comes down to and you'll see numerous reference throughout this video to babylon is fallen so up here in italics you can see previous concepts i've looked into so be sure to ask or watch those videos now notice here four and seven breaks down to eleven this is the lust card this is the chief magic number the number of points on the cliff off it's a very important number um, but so I want to show you one other thing here though since Dale and Gribble have these interesting 44 and 77 uh, pieces built into them let's add them together and notice that you get 121 now this is very interesting because 121 is the simple value of Dennis Slaggle now I believe I have him for you here I just want you to see all of this official like right so you have him as the president of Mack trucks also notice this nice seven that's carved into the side of the dog's face there um, and we'll talk about that very important June 11th founding uh, in just a moment here but so very important um, that the president has that same coding as what happens when we add Dale's name together so notice as well here you get Don Trump blood sacrifice revelation top secret all of these pieces and something that I do want to bring up here just while we're on it since um, 726 comes up I want you to see that in 1933 it's listed here that Mack trucks helps in the building of many American structures including the Hoover Dam now very interesting um, the Hoover Dam is 726 feet tall um, right here 726 you do have that point four if you type it into Google it's 726 even but you see the point there now again the year 33 that um, 
excuse me, master Masonic number, but check a, take a look at these coordinates for Hoover Dam. Three and six is nine, and then five and six is 11. So you have a nice 911 hidden in there, as well as all the different readings. But look at this, 114, there's another 44, and the 16, again, that tower card. So again, something very major looking to be hidden here. And as we're gonna talk about a little later on on the 114th anniversary uh, Mack trucks changed their uh, logo and their slogan and all of that so again we're gonna get to that later but how all of that lines up think about as well 114 inverted 411 is uh, the street that Kennedy was shot on 411 Elm Street um, so now let's jump back here because there's so much information with all this um, so do notice again America Babylon comes up in this coding for Dennis Slagle um, and you do have to wonder because Don Trump and blood sacrifice will be reoccurring themes throughout this video as well but notice here talking about him wearing, always wearing that hat Mac does have that Jewish value of 44 which again we're seeing everywhere at this point already but that's also the same value as ICBM, as in intercontinental ballistic missile, um, as in the one that North Korea allegedly launched today, testing out. And again, I was talking about on the 4th of July, we were going to see this crazy stuff going on. Um, and this is the headlines that I was waking up to about North Korea testing successfully uh, this ICBM. So big deal. Notice as well, it's the same as EMI, which is Emergency Management Institute. This is a division of FEMA, very important. Um, and again, Dale Gribble did have that same coding as FEMA camps. Again, you can see all of that, him connected up to that 77, the caduceus, the big lie, all of it. All right, Dale is <laughs> right in the middle here. So let's go back up here though, I don't want to get ahead of anything. Um, you can check out the ES values here, but what I really want to show you is that they were founded on June 11th, and again, 6 times 11 gives us that 66. This is very important, because as I noted earlier, this comes up in the Skull and Bones coding, the 47 coding uh, that we were just looking at. And so what's also important about June 11th um, is it's the date that I've actually gotten in trouble for discussing in the past. Um, you can see, and this <laughs> This is amazing to me um, that the video of mine that was blocked worldwide for no reason talked about this in the Pez theory. You can see why YouTube banned my 611 video. It's because I was talking about an event to happen on that date. And there was a whole bunch of shit going on. And so, in any case, that video got banned. I was irritated about it. Um, June 11th is also the date that John Wayne died at 72 massive figure in all of this could go on and on but do notice 1900 again 19 resh the sun card um, importantly though 2017 is going to be 117 year anniversary already was since we're now in july again 117 breaks down to 77 but look at 117 it's the same as Welcome Home, as well as Fifth Avenue, location of not only Trump Tower, uh, which we'll talk about, but also Jared Kushner's 666 uh, building. And do remember all of that amazing information um, <clears throat> from the, uh, what is it? It's right over here. What the hell is the movie called? <laughs> the last movie I was looking at with... Um, Arnold Schwarzenegger, it's just going to drive me nuts, I have to get the title of it now, Aftermath, Jesus, <laughs> uh, do remember that that movie was released on um, May 7th, and so again, all the four sevens, it's a very important, it's a great video, um, I don't know why I just had that total lapse there, I think it's because a tremendous amount of information here, but again, you can see more of that, that I've gone into on the side for you there. Um, but so notice as well though, T Phoenix comes up in here and the whole T Phoenix 10 bit will come up later. Uh, but do remember that is from our nice 1988 Economist cover. Again, I've done a great video uh, 
about that for you but so look into all of that now notice here for dale alvin gribble his full name you do have illuminati's freemasons as well as resurrection of the dead you do get the numbers 1416 now this is very important because it's the same as the 33rd degree as well as 500 and a 10 and 5 remember this is the prophetic number from dante's divine comedy which will also come up do notice for 500 and a 10 and 5, 2017 is the Jewish value. And again, all of this very important. I've looked into um, at extreme depth for you in the past. Dante's Divine Comedy, all the words are six letters, the triple six, these two 16s, all the things that I've gone into for you, all right? So again, notice you can rearrange those letters, though, into 1146 and that becomes the same as geared for victory now in a moment here i'm going to show you this nice propaganda piece from mac defense about how they are gearing the military for victory so again you can see all of this coding in here do notice as well um, this very interesting 53g uh, which you can look at it's 537 it's order from chaos expect change but um, very importantly uh, dale alvin gribble is the same es values as thelemic order terrorism god of baphomet i mean these are huge pieces in here and not to mention all the things i've looked into in the past for you regarding that number so now keep moving here though because his birthday is said to be july 12th 712 is execution buildings burned and fake apocalypse now 47 days after his birthday will be 828 now this is crazy to me because 828 is the english value for pez theory it's also the same as donald trump master mason great architect but look at that simple value of 138 there <clears throat> because this is something i've talked about um at very extensive length for you here though but this we are 138 from the misfits bullet ep again you can see the song is one minute 37 seconds we'll go over that later um but again massively important connections there uh released on plan nine records uh because that will come up a lot but so again huge huge piece there um but so take a look at this here so this uh, geared for, and I've talked about this so much in the past, the Pez Theory stuff, uh, you've really got a ton of information. But So look at this geared for victory piece here. And you see here that they're just talking about uh, the whole platoon of vehicles that, have, that Mac has made that have enabled the US military and many other militaries at this point to spread forward and it's different I just think in thinking about all of this than with things like bombs or guns bullets so forth because the Mack trucks and as we'll talk about later the Bulldogs they're actually showing that something is arriving there and is going to be taking up some space and occupying it's a completely different idea than just an all-out aerial assault or something from afar when you've got these coming through um, it's a much different force that's at hand and so again I just want you to see um, from everything from the Army the Navy the Coast Guard the Marines Mac is there and I almost feel like that's part of why Mac computers are so very popular is because it's again just getting us to always have that idea in our head of Mac 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 is the bet right it's just <laughs> so very interesting to think about so again you can just see all of the influence with buses and rigs and fire trucks look at all this shit all right so really big deal so let's look at geared for victory you see references to corrupt justice and mount etna eruption slash tsunami now this is huge you get the date august 31st the revelation 615 now this is the sixth seal and it's uh 
noted as terror, so 615 reduces to 66. It's another 66 for you tying back. Um, but now do notice here before I read this that the ES values for this are underground caves. Now with that, Revelation 615 is then the kings of the earth, the nobles, the commanders, the rich, the mighty, and every slave and free man hid in the caves and among the rocks and the mountains. Very interesting. Notice here, terror network, power of the dark side and con contributions to society. That's essentially what this propaganda piece is really, right, getting to at the heart of things and saying what they have done for everybody for the world why they're okay notice geared for victory also has the same coding as dante's divine comedy so we we're just talking about over here also the same as the day of be with us this is another massive apocalyptic tale notice as well <laughs> it's the same as code 13 7 now remember this is the length of that song bullet um, that we were just looking at from the Misfits. 137 is the same coding as American Bulldog, as well as Mind Control and Eye of Horus. Now, as I've been saying, the Bulldog is the logo, and it does have that 7 on it, and we're going to look into uh, the role that Bulldogs have played. But before we do that, I do want you to see that, because it has the numbers 1368 written out, those are the same as United States of America as well as adult film industry. And again, this is a huge piece of all of this because all of that energy um, that is being given out through those mediums, but notice as well, FEMA concentration camps. So all of that, again, massively tied in here. But you also have references to biblical occultists, the secret doctrine, 88 years. Remember that 2017 is the 88th year since the Great Depression of 1929. 88, of course, a massive number on its own. But so let's look into the coding here for Mack trucks because the Jewish value is 527, which if we invert is the address of Trump Tower on Fifth Avenue and 527 is the same as Plan 9 Records. Again, really just want to burn this into your head, right? All of that just loops back and back and back. And so you see here now, Morningstar, Eye of God, House of Death, Clopothic Tree. You see as well, Climate Hoax, MSM, Big Hoax, Mainstream Media, and The Reptilians, which is always interesting to see how they come up. Now, notice here as well, uh, the ES values for Mack trucks, huge as far as past concepts. But just outright, Illuminati, Mac Bulldogs, the truth, 4-4. Four, four. Now, Mac Bulldogs are what the British uh, called the trucks during World War II, where they played a really monumental role um, in just the way that things went. And so um, I don't have the link pulled up for you, but again, I'll try to put it down below. It's a really easy thing to research. Um, but so you do have 4-4 four, four written out there and do remember that Mac has that Jewish value of 44 and all the other ones that we've looked into along the way. Also coming up here, the architect, hidden master, um, and uh, security. Now, since Bulldog has come up here multiple times now, we saw the Code 137, the American Bulldog, um, and then here we have the Mac Bulldog, same as Mac Trucks. I want to look into why they chose the Bulldog. And again, um, as I stated earlier on here, let's pull them up. They have this nice seven on this Bulldog's face, and that's a really big deal. And so getting back here, though, Bulldog is an obvious anagram for Bull God, all right? And so a reference to Satan right there. And so again, why I'm referencing that number seven being so important that it's on that dog's face. Now, I want to look at a few very popular Bulldogs. And the most, I think, notable one here is going to be the Yale Bulldog because he is number 33. Uh, which you can see him wearing on a number of jerseys. Um, but do notice all of the one eye symbolism that comes up with this bulldog. Um, and again, 
Yale is the location of Skull and Bones uh, Society. Um, and so with the 33, the One Eyes, the damn Bulldog, the Mack Trucks, that really just compounds in there. But so now the current one here is uh, Handsome. Dan is the name of Yale's mascot. And it's currently on its 18th uh, embodiment. So remember, 18 is the moon card. Now, I wanted to show you here for Handsome Dan 18 with the Roman numerals there. Um, it does have a Jewish value of 1300 and reluctantly I'll tune you in here that it does have the same value as Zachary K. Hubbard. Now, ugh, I haven't really discussed this individual um, since I made a video on him back on my original channel that was banned. Um, matter of fact, not too long after I made the video on him. Um, but so it is important to note though, because it does seem like he's really trying to spread out his web. Um, when his most recent channel, uh, or when his channel was shut down, uh, recently, um, I saw that he was going to make a bid to run for president, uh, in 2020 and wanted a hundred grand, um, in order to do so. And I just... <laughs> couldn't believe just what a just moronically ballsy move that was um because if anyone was paying attention and especially anybody who does research into these sorts of things one of the very first concepts you familiarize with is that uh the president is who they say it will be um and not any other way and it's a completely just uh, arbitrary position in any case but to say that you can run for president and that you would actually win would be in one way a partial admission to being a part of these groups that would allow such a thing to happen. Um, but in any case, it just to me speaks to, again, the fraudulent nature of his entire character um, and that he's just looking for more money from everybody who's, you know, kind of just ignorant enough to give it to him. But in any case, you also see coming up there, Martyr of the Antichrist. And so again, something very interesting with him uh, could absolutely be on the horizon here. It is, I mean, the name, these letters here, Z, K, H, this reduces to 8. We could reduce the K to 2 if we added 1 and 1. And 8 from the H does give us that 828, which is Pez theory, which is very interesting here because ES values for Handsome Dan 18 are the Pez theory, as well as the number 7, the great architect, right? All of these pieces here, Order of the Rose, hiding the truth, massive, massive things. But so in any case here, you can see a couple more uh, pieces coming out. Bub, Bulldog, Briscoe is from Frasier. Jay's pet bulldog is named Stella from Modern Family. The British Bulldog or the B uh, British Bulldogs, uh, which is the tag team, but that is from WWF. Beatles had a song called Hey Bulldog, right? It's 3 minutes and 11 seconds, 3.11.33. Um, but on and on and on. So why the bulldog? Um, and so when you look into the coding for it, the bulldog is the same Jewish value as the face of Satan, as well as the Pentagon and I am chosen to lead. The ES values are the same as beast of death, as well as nuclear bomb, divine plan, Heil Hitler, snuff film, on and on. And so as well here, do notice that bulldog on its own, we have it starting, excuse me, starts with the letter B, number two and it's seven letters so 27 is a death number jewish values 303 we can drop that zero for 33 but you do see the demon god and infernal god the dark one um, and you do have this reference to reichstag um, which was very interesting because of course 47 meters tall it's a huge number we've been talking about today now what's really interesting here is construction on the reichstag started on the 9th of june 1884 and katy perry released her witness album on that same date this year which remember was the full strawberry moon uh, but very interestingly though that was a 133 year difference in between those two and so when um, we can reduce that down, of course, to 33, 1 times 33, but so 133 is the same as government, book of the law, this is a hoax. It's 
been a really huge number that we've seen come up. You get White House, New World Ahead, uh, Salve Coagula, this um, very monumental uh, piece um, just towards understanding what is going on here with the building of the nation before the complete destruction of the nation, um, as well as this idea of God bless America, extinction, terminator, evolution. It's a very massive number, that 133, all right? So now let's jump back over here, though. And for those of you not familiar with Reichstag, um, let's pull that up for you really quick just so you can see um, that this was a really important event that happened when it caught on fire as many feel that it was a false flag that was conducted by Hitler and his regime in order to get full-on power and as you can see here after the burning of the Reichstag it um, essentially enabled them to sign into effect the enabling act which then pretty much gave Hitler the opportunity to do whatever he wanted for four years on paper and so is a very very important event to say the least um, and what's very interesting is that um, it is also the same as Pentagon which again you can think back to the 9-11 attacks and you know that being a very similar idea there of course the Twin Towers Building 7 all the other things um, but the Pentagon and Reichstag having that same coding they're very very important with that concept now do notice down below here you do have quite a bit more for Bulldog, um, but what I want to show you here is their new slogan. And so let's see if we can jump back here. So you do have their new logo, and again, I was talking earlier about all of the uh, importance of 114, the connection to Hoomer Dam, you know, yada yada. Uh, but so notice here, their new tagline is Mack Trucks Born Ready. And so when we take a look at that, we do get Donald J. Trump, as well as Revelation 18. So we can look at this a few ways. R is 18 and E is 5. And so with that, we do have a 185. Now, this is very crucial because it is the same as Donald John Trump as well as Judgment slash the Star. Now, again, these are the two cards that are tilted on the Economist cover. I have a full video on this for much more discussing that. Uh, but very important that that all comes up. You have Book of Revelation, Foretold by the Bible, the Masterpiece Ion, these massive concepts here, as well as a perfect illusion. It goes on and on. Uh, but so Revelation 18 is the fall of Babylon. Now, we'll get to that in just a minute here. I'll just show you now uh, the fall of Babylon. As you can see here, its simple value is 156, which is the number of Our Lady Babylon. But those codes are also the same as Planet Trump, T Phoenix 10. And so again, Planet Trump is on this cover as well. And again, T Phoenix 10 from this Economist cover. It's very important how those come up. But notice as well, 666, 33, as above, so below. Um, it's really quite impressive. Now, I want you to see as well here, Mildred Z. Solomon, because she has written out 936. And I was talking about her before Trump was elected president and the fact that President Donald Trump came up in her coding in relation to a number of other things we were looking at would signify him ascending to presidency and lo and behold now notice as well her es values also reference revelation 18 and so um it's very interesting now let's jump back over here though and for those of you curious just to see a little more on it i do have this for you you can look into it fallen fallen is babylon the great here and why it's a very long excerpt uh, so I'm not going to go into it uh, but so do notice here as well though for Mack trucks born ready the ES values are the same as witness worldwide that is Katy Perry's current tour remember KP 1116 triple one times six triple six witness worldwide those three W's it's five 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 
Um, and again, all of these huge, huge pieces. Donald John Trump Sr., that's our guy, um, as well as Morningstar slash Lucifer, True Holy Angel of Death, Impossible Coincidences, Key to the Apocalypse, The Draconian Tradition, The Beast of Revelation, and this idea of Revelation 6-8. So if you're curious, Revelation 6-8, And I looked, and behold, a pale horse, and his name that sat on him was Death. And hell followed with him. And power was given unto them over the fourth part of the earth to kill with sword and with hunger and with death and with the beasts of the earth. And so how very interesting that they debut that logo, that symbol, all those things, right? Fall of Babylon. Now, notice here, there's a difference between Mack Trucks INC and Mack Trucks, or excuse me, Mack Defense. LLC. All right, you can see it's a wholly owned subsidiary of Mack Trucks Incorporated. Um, and what's important to note here is that, again, this is the defense, this is the military contract here. And so, what's the big difference between an LLC and an INC, right? Um, and so, you see here that the LLC doesn't pay income taxes on its profits big deal when we're talking about military equipment and on the contrary right double taxation could result to incorporations and so you see a huge incentive there to make it an LLC now look Mac defense that's another 44 LLC does give us a triple three now notice here change in America the demon notice down below the ES values apocalypse operation universe trumpet the name of God, the hand of fate. Notice as well, Salvatore, Christ, Ra, L. Huge pieces here. Notice for Mack Trucks, INC, you get irrefutable decode using Gematria, as well as the sacred secret, the demonic Cliffhoth, Manchurian candidate, and suicide bombers. Now look here, the ES values for Mack Trucks, INC. There you have me. All right just to be able to give you all of this and remember this is this is just such a massive number here with all these things we've talked about but the apocalypse the blood of a goat global control manifestation and what coped us, the universe financial crisis divine wisdom destructive so many things all right and so i guess i've got a couple more pieces for you on the way out here uh, Dale his, himself, if we look at his name, Jewish value, gives us the letter M. Remember, that's the 13th letter, the death card. KKK, notice the English value. V, the sign of Typhon, Typhoon, most powerful deity, monster. CNBC, DOC, could be so many things. Um, but so, Dale's dead bug. Do notice here, um, the words 5, 4, and 3 are the letters. So 543 plus 345 is 888, which is the same as Donald J. Trump. You get Big Brother, Control, the Infernal, or excuse me, Inferno, Secret Magic, Tinfoil Hat, Big Brother, Hermetic Kabbalah. Now notice here the ES values are the same as Plan 9 and Mike Judge. Mike Judge is the creator of King of the Hill. It's the same as The Devil, Hail Satan, CBS News excuse me, blackout, the earth, tantric. And so I think the last thing I want to show you here, since John Redcorn is the one who is having the affair with his wife, it's important to note that he's John Redcorn the third. Um, but so you do have Bohemian Grove, the 13th tarot card, JPL Comet Elenin, Jet Propulsion Laboratory, remember located in Pasadena, California, uh, which was coded earlier here just so you can see with this 47 bit and again I've talked a lot about Pasadena in the past um, but yes very important location skull and bone sharing that same coding uh, but notice as well the author of disaster the unexplainable coincidence ES values same as love is the law this is a part of a thelemic phrase Rosie cross building a world fall of mankind all right all these big pieces so there you can take a look at these last bits that i have typed in for you here 
combination of Dale and Mac does give us this idea of peace. And again, because I just think it's so interesting to think about with the peace sign. Let's uh, let's jump back here real quick, since I've got you. Okay. So, of course, relating to this idea of the cross of narrow, it's an inverted cross broken at the anchor and enclosed in a circle representing narrow's vision. Nero believed there would be world peace without Christianity, and he killed thousands of Christians because of this. Now, you can also see it's also known as the dead man's rune and can be seen on the tombstone of some of Adolf Hitler's SS troops. Now, of course, the peace sign became very familiar on the Volkswagen bus, uh, the love bug, so on. But VW is very interesting because VW is the 22nd and the 23rd letters of the alphabet. And so for just doing this, we would do triple two times three. And so that does give us that nice triple six there as well. But so do notice DXV, this was the translation of 515. But America, Donald, Resch, encoded, you name it. All right, so I think that is all that I have for you in this video today. You can also see the Bulldogs are in the end of a number of, of these Fail Army videos. On and on and on. But in any case, I believe that's everything that I have for you today. Um, I really appreciate you taking the time to watch these videos course please research everything further look into these dates um, look into these connections um, there's a ton of things in here that I always mean to go over but I end up missing or just wanting to so so please just feel free to comment etc ask things um, but just very in interesting information so again um, thank you so very much for taking the time to watch and please please be well